takes place right here in West Michigan. Um, and you'll see she goes on all these adventures, and now Felicity has a new adventure, and that's what you'll find in a second in the series. Um, it all has a lot to do with weather, and yes, there's a lot of science in the book, but for the most part, it's about being a human. It's about being a person, a person who doesn't know that they can do something and then learns that they can. And that's what the story is really about. So that's what my story's about. I mean, Felicity's me, let's be real. I based the story completely on myself <laughs> and what I wish would have happened. That was me, slightly cuter now, right? Born in actually California. So I was born in Southern California in a place called Orange. But luckily for me, my family moved me to West Michigan. I know people are like, wait, that's a good thing? Or a good weather-wise? But weather-wise it was because I started seeing seasons. If I would have stayed in Southern California, I don't think I would have ever become a meteorologist. So my brother and I, living in West Michigan, spent one entire summer on the Great Lake, on Lake Michigan itself. That's a picture of my grandmother and my cousins, my brother and I. And that huge lake, I don't need to tell all of you. When I tell this to other students around the country, you know they have no idea what Michigan even is, let alone what Lake Michigan is. But you know how big and broad that lake is and how you can see forever. One day, my brother and I were out there playing, and we had a chance to see a lot of storms. But this one particular day, we're making a sandcastle, and my brother has always been a little, you know, little brothers are sometimes dramatic. So he starts, oh, oh my gosh. And I'm like, whatever, I'm building a sandcastle. I got things to do. He keeps kind of freaking out, and then all of a sudden he starts really screaming. And then I hear my mom scream. And then I look up, and we see something like this. I was like eight years old, and we saw water spots. It was an unbelievable moment in my life because they're screaming, ah! and then here's me, 